Mia-san, konnichiwa. So, I have a new setup now. I got me a new camcorder and everything, and things are looking up. Uh, started a new job recently, and you know, still planning to go to WrestleMania this year. It's in New Orleans. Uh, if anyone's going out there, uh, let me know. I want to see if I can maybe these are people who watch these videos, you know. Uh, but yeah, today let's talk about one of the most impressive guys in pro wrestling. And I say one of the most impressive because if you ever look on Wikipedia, which is where I get a lot of info sometimes, well, most of the time, uh, and, and look at his moveset, you can realize that this guy does so many moves, it's almost like they have to make a separate Wikipedia page just for his moveset. And of course I'm talking about... Can you see that? Can you see? Can you see? Chris Hero. It's it's it's, it's Chris Hero. Sorry about the lighting. I just now realized that, that I, I gotta work on that. <laughs> anyway, uh, I have actually met Chris Hero a couple of times, and when you meet him in person, this guy could not be nicer. He could not be more respectful. He could not be friendlier with the fans. And he could not be, like, just a cooler guy to approach. And, I mean, for a guy who's been all around the world, you know, Europe, Japan, you know, States, Mexico, Canada, you know, just, just this really humble, down-to-earth guy. And if you ever, if you ever see a Chris Hero match live, you should know, and, and if you have something you do know, you're going to get your money's worth every single time. Most recently... Chris Hero was in WWE Developmental and NXT, and they released him. Yeah. Easily the, one of the dumbest things they ever did. I can't count the CM Punk thing because CM Punk left. Now, you know, and, and, and if and if when I'm recording this, CM Punk does come back, then, you know, that doesn't count anymore. I still think Chris, letting Chris Hero go when he was Cassius Ono oh was just... It, 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 it was dumb. Moving on. Ignore that. But recently... Chris Hero was in Austin at Inspire Pro and wrestled Ray Rowe. Both men are in ROH right now, but this was, I think, their first ever meeting, like, you know, just ever. And this was back in January. We're in March now. Uh, I'm, you know, yeah. We're in March, sorry. But they had a match in January, and it was easily match of the year candidate. A match of the year. How do you start off the year like that? Easy. You get a class act like Rero and and you know who's up and coming who's who's you know not really up and coming but to the rest of the world he's up and coming to us in Texas and in the, in the, in the, from the Cleveland area where he's from we already knew that Rero's already destined for great things um and you have Chris Hero world class tra traveler uh, you know wrestler he's wrestled all over the globe he's you do pretty much you name it he's wrestled them and in most cases beat him but you know, there's and, and 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 by the way, I've seen personally, I've seen Chris Hero wrestle a lot of people, and he has never ever failed to impress me in a match. I'll put it to you this way: if you, any of you know who Masada is, Masada is one of the most hardcore wrestlers you'll ever see because Masada can you know can do it all, but. Even he had to switch up his game against Chris Hero. Chris Hero was even shocked because Masada, during the match, he was like, you know, he was like, okay, I gotta go put him away. And he used a Hurricane Rana, which just took, not only took Hero by surprise, it took us by surprise. We didn't even know Masada could do one. And even Hero on himself got on the mic and said, last thing I expected from Masada was him put an effing Hurricane Rana. He said the word, but you know, I'm trying to stay a little bit PG here. Uh, <laughs> and, um, and, no, and that's another thing about Chris Hero. He does not hesitate to get on the mic and... And if he and if he like likes what he sees, he will say it. That's awesome. That's that's great. That's that's fantastic. Chris Hero is like I said, he's a class act. He's one of the best in the world right now. Right now he is um uh well what both did he win recently? He uh, won the Evolve Championship. He beat A. R. Fox. Um and he's a you know, four world champion in C Z W, you know and he's was one half of one of the most illustrious tag teams in wrestling history, the Kings of Wrestling. Him and Claudio were this perfect unit of of, of a tag team, and they were two-time Ring of World Tag Team Champions. 
you know, he oh he's a PWG world champion. And his those credentials just goes on and on and on. I can talk about Chris Hero credentials for days and, and let alone let alone his moveset. He's like the master of the rolling elbow. I mean, any way you can think of, he's a master of the cravat. He's a master of uh, the hero's welcome, which is a rolling cutter. He does that like 18 different ways. He can do different suplexes. He can do different versions of the mafia kick. He invented his own version of the uh, Texas Cloverleaf, which he calls the Riviera Cloverleaf. And respect to the men who trained him, another legend, uh, Sky Day, also a uh, uh, real name, Jorge Riviera. And I've met Sky Day too. That is another class act. Oh my god, that guy was nice considering that he's like a legend. Not, not like a legend, considering he is a legend in this business. That's another guy. So if 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 humility and humbleness is just what this guy exudes, then Chris Hero got it also in spades. So Chris Hero is definitely one of the best in the world. You know, he used to be known as you know that young knockout kid. Now he calls himself the knockout artist. And who in the world is going to argue with that? He has wrestled against everybody who you can probably name right now. Just about. If not, then he's wrestled, you know, someone that you can't name that they still had a five-star match. I'm sure maybe some of you watching this have no idea who Ray Rowe is. And why don't you? But anyway, I should do a video, video on Ray Rowe. I should do an interview with Ray Rowe. Anyway, that's a new hero there. But, I mean, Chris Hero is that kind of guy who you need to put your guys against. Not only to, you know, let those guys see if they can hang with a big dog, you know, like, like Hero, but... Chris Hero, I think, is just a career is just a career maker. If you want your guys to have a fantastic match, or or at least learn from someone who can make who can always have a fantastic match, you put him against Chris Hero. Chris Hero to me is like has kind of like how Chris Jericho is in WWE whenever he you know comes back. He's like that measuring stick that a lot of guys need to have in order to know you know okay you know you're pretty good you're you're decent you know this that or the other thing. Chris Hero is this. Uh, amazing amazing wrestler and just amazing amazing person and this is what I've seen I've met him a, a, you know a handful of times we got an autograph a few times and took pictures with him and everything and I and and I just you know maybe I'm just you know singing the praises of you know someone I just know just purely as a fan but you know from a fan who's talked to him several times he's never been you know you know oh you know no you know I'll hurry up and you know do all that. no he's always been like you know you know hey you know nice to meet you what's your name he's like yeah sure let's take a picture and he'll make goofy faces in the pictures and he'll hang, you know you know he like you know talks to fans that I you know I like make comments to him like I see like leaving the ring and he'll like you know like he'll say something back he'll be witty and he's and he's and he's great you know I, and, and of course you know I'm a, I'm a wrestling mark singing the praises of Chris Hero what internet wrestling mark hasn't done that I, you know. <laughs> but th this is this is just me saying that Chris Hero is one of the best right now. Also, and I showed you the, and I showed you the DVD, the you know Chris Hero Ring of Hero DVD. It's on RHWrestling.com right now. Other store. I'll do my best to remember to provide a link at the bottom. Um, get the DVD definitely because it, it's it's easy to know Chris Hero's good. It's also easy to forget how good until you see. Like some of the matches in here, like uh, what match was it? Okay, here's a match. Uh, there's a match on here on the disc one where he wrestles El Generico, Glory by Honor, uh, six night two. Um, nothing like like super like you know stand about. It's just a great match, and there's some great fun in it. Uh, you know, he's like kind of teasing El Generico, doing a lot of like flips and stuff, and you know, and that kind of like thing, and. He's, he's just great. When he got released from WWE, I was bummed. <clears throat> because I was bummed because I thought, you know, they have screwed up royally. And they did. Chris Hero, whenever he was called to the main roster, as he well should have been before before then, what was going to give them everything he had, then some, and then walk, and then, and then all fans would have gone all happy. I think Vince would have had an easily another CM Punk situation on his hands had Chris Hero been allowed to get, get called into the main roster. Not to say that he did bad in NXT, because he didn't. He was, he was very good in NXT. I just think they should have done more with him. I really do. Um, it, 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 but it's a win for us on the indie circuit. I know that uh, there are guys who, who work at Inspire Pro Wrestling who are, trying to get, who are working to get him back. 
I can't wait for that. Chris Hero can show up anywhere. And if I can make it, I'm going to make it. And it's not just the matches. It's not just the personality. It's just, it's just, it's not just that kind of, it's just everything he brings to the table at the same time. He brings all of that with him. Chris Hero brings the fun too. Oh man, Chris Hero can bring, bring some fun to wrestling. And that's also something super cool about him. He brings a lot of fun to pro wrestling. So, but you know, that's just my opinion. What are your opinions on Chris Hero? And matter of fact, what are some of your favorite Chris Hero matches, moments, what's your favorite move he does? You know, you know, I'm just a huge proponent for the rolling elbow in any form, so that's just, you know, one of my favorites of all time. It's one of my favorite finishers. Um, so, you know, yeah, what do you guys think? What like what are your some of your favorite like Chris Hero moments or something like that? Uh let me know. Leave me a comment or a video response or you know, just let me know. And if you have a link to your, like, maybe your favorite Chris Hero match, if there's a link out there, you know, show it to me. Maybe I haven't seen it yet, and I would love to see it. I love, I love, of course I love watching wrestling, so I, I'd love to see another Chris Hero match that maybe I haven't seen before. Maybe I'll even, if I can't remember, I'll try to pull a link of, like, some of maybe the top moves that a lot of the guys do, like, uh, I know Thunderflies does one, uh, Chainsaw Proof is really good for those. And, you know, yeah, give me some of your favorite Chris Hero moments, or, you know, and, you know, if you want to complain about how did he screw the pooch on that one, <laughs> go ahead and let me know. But, until then, thank you guys for watching, thank you for listening to me ramble on. I do have some more stuff planned, but like I said, new job, new things come, and then, like, you know, my my time is uh, definitely, definitely a lot shorter than I have now, still working on finishing the novel, hopefully, 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 like I said, bye end of this month or by the end of April and then maybe I'll have the draft uh, like it all drafted all finished out and ready to ship out and everything by June that is my goal that's what I'm working towards thank you all so much for watching I appreciate it I appreciate all the love and support and I will see you guys soon and Mina-san sayonara